There is a desperate need for volunteer firefighters, not only in green country, but across the U.S. According to the Oklahoma State Firefighters Association, volunteers are down by 30%. Yeah, imagine being in a car accident or having your house on fire and having to wait 20, 30, maybe even 40 minutes for help. Well, that's what it would look like without volunteer firefighters outside of the city of Tulsa. Each time Flat Rock Fire Chief Dwayne Givens pulls out of his fire station, he hopes he has enough volunteer firefighters on hand. I'm always looking for help. Right now, he has 13 volunteers, a number he wishes was twice as high. When you realize as a volunteer fire department, you've got to grab everybody that you can get from the area that you live in. I mean, it's, and the area that you live in is pretty sparsely populated. Givens has been running emergency calls here for 11 years. In that time, he's seen as many as 16 volunteers and as little as eight. Some challenges, well, folks aren't paid, of course, and the training is tough. A lot of physical stuff. You have to carry somebody up a ladder, break into stuff, um, a lot of book reading, a lot of test taking. Kelly Bustle is a face and a voice you may recognize. After working in radio for nearly 30 years in Tulsa, she felt in her heart it was time to try something new and joined her husband in volunteering at Flat Rock Fire. I feel like I've joked around my whole life in radio, and now it's like I want to do something a little more meaningful and help people. That's music to the chief's ears, who is calling on more volunteers. He says men and women alike are all welcome on his team. If you look at a rural department, a volunteer fire department, you're going to have a good mix. There are a lot of uh, female volunteer firefighters, and there are a lot of good ones, really good ones. And if you're interested in answering the call for help, for more information about volunteering, there was a fish fry at the department on Saturday from 4 till 7. I'm told it's a great time for the whole family, kids and everybody, an opportunity too, to check out the station and ask any questions you might have about volunteering.